Folks, my pillow CEO, Mike Lindell, is pissed off. Like he is just pissed the hell off about what happened this past week. Like most of the rest of the country that has a rational thinking brain, Mike Lindell is angry that Kevin McCarthy gave Tucker Carlson at Fox news exclusive access to 41,000 hours of surveillance footage from the Capitol on January 6, 2021. Now the problem is that Mike Lindell is not mad that this is a security threat. Mike Lindell is not, well, he is mad that he thinks Fox is going to ca- craft a counter narrative, but the counter narrative he thinks they're going to craft is actually one to downplay the events that day. So that's, that's kind of weird. So he's wrong about that, but I'll give him credit. His heart's in the right place. Tucker Carlson should not be the only person to have an access to this. Mike Lindell thinks he should be the only person having access to this. And that's why he's so pissed off. He went on Steve Bannon's war room podcast the other day and said this, um, why does just Fox get this so they can cover it up even more? It's disgusting. Like cover it up. How like Fox has covered up the events of January 6th by downplaying it repeatedly. Are, are we to believe that Mike Lindell is, is the kind of guy that thinks January 6th was terrible. He thinks it's an insurrection. Do you think Fox news is going to tell us it was an insurrection or not tell us it's an insurrection? I don't understand your thinking about Fox covering it up. There's a real danger of Fox covering it up. Tucker Carlson is crafting a narrative to try to show people, look, nothing happened that day. Here's one camera. You don't even see people. They're just calmly walking down the hall doing nothing. The whole day was a sham. That's what's going to happen. But I think Lindell thinks <laughs> that Tucker Carlson's going to say, look at these violent idiots. They're crazy. They think the election was stolen, which isn't what's going to happen. It's going to be the opposite. Mike Lindell's going to get everything he wants, but he is right that Tucker Carlson shouldn't have exclusive access. So what he's done is he sent a petition, <laughs> very poorly written, apparently to Kevin McCarthy, speaker of the house. And he says, gosh, darn it, McCarthy. I I hope he started the letter that way. I really hope it just says, gosh, darn it. (laughs) I have a first amendment right to get my hands on those videotapes too for Lindell TV. And it's not fair. And I'm being excluded. You're violating my constitutional rights. And if you don't grant them to me, I am going to sue you. And, uh, he reconfirmed that of course, with the daily beast, they called him like, Hey, are you really like threatening to sue Kevin McCarthy? He's like, Oh yes, I am. My Mike Lindell impression is actually getting worse. I'm sorry. Um, so there it is. And there you have it. Mike Lindell is threatening to sue the speaker of the house of representatives because he can't get his hands on those 41,000 hours. Now here's the thing. And this kind of poses a bit of a moral problem. Doing the right thing for the wrong reasons. Is that still considered the right thing to do? Because yes, suing Kevin McCarthy to force these tapes to be released to all media is the right thing to do. But clearly Mike Lindell is doing it for the wrong reasons. But if he's successful, it's still a win for the country. So it would be the right thing, but he's doing it for the wrong reasons. So do we support it? Should we support it? I'm going to go with yes. In this particular instance, it's the right thing. He's got the wrong reasons, but if it's successful, it might be able to put an end to Fox News's counter narrative about January 6th before it can really take hold. These tapes, if you're going to release them need to go to everybody, not just one wackadoo over at Fox. Who's already downplayed the events of that day for two straight years. It's all or nothing. So I hope Lindell does sue and I hope he wins. It's a weird thing to say, (laughs) but in this particular instance, Mike Lindell, I support what you're doing. I don't support why you're doing it, but I do support it. If you choose to sue Kevin McCarthy over this, because I think the country needs that. Hi everyone. This here is little Athena and Athena would like to know why you haven't subscribed to fair and balanced yet. So please 
Don't let Athena down. Subscribe today.